Hello everyone, my name is Dino. For those of you who are new here in my channel, I am a professional 2D animator from the Philippines, and this is now my third video. Today, I will be showing you how materials are waving as they move through the wind, or when the wind is blowing around soft materials. But before we proceed, please click like and subscribe to my channel. Also, click the notification bell for updates when I upload new videos. Don't forget to share too! Now let's begin! You can imagine a wave as a line curved multiple times and then slide to either direction. Let us identify the parts of a wave. Number 1. The crest. Number 2. The node. And number 3. The trough. These will be your key references when animating a wave. They will be your guide when you draw the breakdowns or the drawings between each key drawings, called simply in between. For example, drawing 3 is the breakdown of drawings 1 and 5 as shown here. You should notice that the node part of the wave of drawings 1 and 5 has been heavily relied on for drawing 3. In many instances, you will find yourself relying heavily also on the crest and trough especially when the poses of the drawings are too complicated and the node part is hardly readable because sometimes when drawing the in-betweens or breakdowns you could end up repeating the motion instead of making the wave continually moving in just one direction. Please take note that whenever I show you two key drawings and an in-between or breakdown the first key drawing will be in red, the second key drawing will be in green and the in-between or breakdown will be in blue. Let's take a look at the movement of the wave one more time. Let's get a portion of the moving wave and see how it behaves. Let's enlarge this portion for better view. Let's place a flagpole top at the left end of the wave as we are going to look at it like we are looking at the top view of a waving flag. Let's place a guide for the waving motion of the flag. Now let's draw a waving flag using the moving wave as a reference. By following the guide for the flag motion, you will see the distance of the crests and troughs of the moving wave from the crests and troughs of the flag. And you will also notice that the nodes of the flag are curved as opposed to the straighter node of the moving wave. So you see that as we freeze the motion and set three drawings, you can notice that the wave parts of the first and last keys are the obvious references for the in-between. With these mechanics, you will never be lost when animating waving materials. Okay, so let us animate the basic flag wave. First, prepare frame one and begin drawing. Then, create a blank page in frame number nine. Drawing number one is shown in faint red. Draw on frame number 9 using frame 1 as reference. Go back to drawing 1, grab it, and reuse it in frame number 17. Return to frame number 9. Number 1 is in red color being shown in the background for reference. Create a new blank space in frame number 5. Frames number 1, red, and number 9, green, are being shown in the background. Begin drawing on frame number 5, while frames number 1 and number 9 are being shown in the background. Return to frame number 9, where drawing number 1 is shown in frame number 17, as a reuse for the loop or cycle. Create a blank space in frame number 13, while number 9 and number 1 are shown in the background. Number 1 is in frame number 17 as a reuse for the loop or cycle. Begin drawing on frame 13 while number 9 and number 1 are shown in the background. Number 1 is in frame 17 as a reuse for the loop or cycle. Return to frame number 1 and show frame number 5 in green. Create a blank space in frame 3. Frames number 1 and number 5 are shown in the background. Begin drawing on frame 3. 
Frames 1 and 5 are shown in the background. Return to frame 5 and show frame 9 in green. Create a blank space in frame 7. Frames number 5 and number 9 are shown in the background. Begin drawing on frame 7. Frames number 5 and number 9 are shown in the background. Return to frame 9 again and show frame 13 in green. Create a blank space in frame 11. Frames 9 and 13 are shown in the background. Begin drawing on frame 11. Frames 9 and 13 are shown in the background. Return to frame 13 and show frame 17 in green, which is actually drawing number 1. Create a blank space in frame 15. Frames 13 and 17 are shown in the background. Begin drawing on frame 15. Frames 13 and 17 are shown in the background. And now, you have a waving flag. Eventually, you will be skilled enough to animate waving flags and other soft materials like this one. Thank you for watching. Don't forget to like and subscribe and click on the notification bell so you'll get updates for new videos where you learn animation with fun. If you have suggestions or requests what I should animate next for you, write on the comment section below. Remember though that I only do wholesome works. See you in my next video guys.